Coffee maker. Let's deal with the coffee maker. Okay, we're going to find out a few things today. Have you ever been curious? I, I was, so I wanted to do this just for kicks. We're going to find out a few things today. Number one is how much does a coffee maker use in electricity when you actually brew a cup of coffee? And then number two is kind of the old argument of, well, do I leave it on all day and all night just to keep the water warm all the time so I can save the two minutes to warm up? Or do I turn it on and off each morning and save electricity or wear and tear in the machine? Uh, also, you turn it off and leave it plugged in, which is the other argument where a lot of electronics nowadays is they uh, tend to draw electricity just sitting there plugged in. And is that true or not? So got to actually measure all these things. So if you haven't watched already the primer video, which explains all this in detail, I'll have a link on the description and also all the results of this test in the description. Uh, if you want to call it a test, and uh, or on the screen here. So that'll explain, that'll explain in that video the electricity rates, how it's a tiered system, at least in where I live. The tiered system is not just straightforward, multiply the rate times the uh, usage. So anyway, the, the results I'm going to give you are a range or an estimate depending on low or high usage. And I think most people are going to fall into the high usage unless you're kind of a one-person dwelling. Um, it's just the way it's structured with the tiers. So... Anyway, to give you a, a magnitude of what's going on. Um, so this is going to take about uh, two minutes to warm up. So uh, when it does, I'll hit the brew button. But just to give you um, an idea, when it's off altogether, not turned on, but just plugged in, it uses a little bit, but it's only 1.4 to 2.4 cents per day. And that's $5.11 to $8.73 a year. So not a big deal. All right, I'm going to hit it. Go ahead and brew and up oh, insert dolphin safe free range coffee brew okay so now i'm going to get some coffee going Download coffee, 56.6 modem way. Okay, so you see the watts going up and down, and the net result is after this cycle's done, and I unplug it to brew one cup of coffee from just room temperature water to warm it up, to brew it and everything, uh, translates into 0.8 to 1.3 cents per cup. Now that's based on my rates and usage and all that. Per year, $2.77, $4 to, to two $4.71 per year. Not a big deal. Um, now, to leave it on all year, now this is the other argument. You want to leave it on and just keep that water warm versus turn it off each night. I did a 28 and a quarter hour test of just leaving it on, not touching it. So it's constantly warming it up. Anyway, it ends up to be roughly 8 to 14 cents per day. Not a big deal. Throw a dime on the counter every day. No, but that's $30 to $51 a year. Adds up over time, but you decide, do you want to turn the thing on and off, plug it and unplug it? Is it worth it? You know, if, you know, you want to burn trees or go outside and club a baby seal, make slippers out of it. I don't know. It's up to you. I don't, I don't really care. But anyway, those are the tests I did. So if you like it, like it, uh, subscribe, and uh, there'll be a lot more of these coming up, um, stuff I'm curious about, the actual usage. And look into the description, again, for the results. Thanks for watching.